Well, I do not have a combat rifle, so, uh... That's not gonna be useful unless I can sell that ammo later. Alright, I think I've opened all the lockers in here. Let's go see if we can say hello to the locals. I thought you were standing over a different way before. Just put that away. Some whiskey, apparently. Let's take that. So is there anything in here? Hello. Nice. City Rise again. I believe we have already seen this. I don't hate you because you work at Isolate or Sarab Industries or wherever the fuck you. I know they don't tell you anything. You don't know anything. How are you supposed to know that this is uncontrolled? Anything else good in here? Oh, wow. There's no roof on this whatsoever. So probably if you made noise and there was someone actually out there, you would be in serious trouble. Alright, so that is the actual way to my objective. But we haven't found the girl. I'm kinda interested in trying to find that girl. Alright, the fact that we have done a lot of stuff, let's go ahead and save real quick. So I am not going back. Don't feel like it. So looks like this is back out to the main area. There's a guy. Another guy right there. question is, would it be easier to just go back down where I came from? There are a lot of guys out here. Ladder going up there. Yeah, I'm not sure there's any wisdom whatsoever in coming back out here. So, you know what? We are going to leave. There might very well be some extra items out there, but I have a feeling there's not going to be the girl that I would like to look for. Did I already grab this? I don't know. Let's make sure. Let's see, that was under this, I believe? That's missions. What is it exactly? Eyes, items. Uh, no. I never said do that. Oh. I didn't even notice this was here. Been staring right at it. Anyway, um... What was it? That's the map, augmentations, this is objectives. I suppose I can use this to go to the logs anyhow. Got that, resist the machine. Oh, I can't even see my logs from before? It's kind of crappy. Can't see it, just a big old list of logs. Whatever. 
I will deal with it. Nothing so far. Anyone in here? It's the locker room. Never mind. Jensen, I just tried to unlock the assembly lab door, but my override codes aren't working. Someone's changed the protocols. What? Didn't you plug the... I'm on it. But until I find this particular breach and fix it, you'll have to hack the door manually. Pritchard out. Great. So I kind of wonder if that girl is, um... The one that's helping these guys. I'm guessing this is a metal detector, so let's not be stupid. All right. Hacking tutorial. When hacking, your goal is to take control of a device's registries. All right. So you can access the security codes within. To do it, you must navigate the network, capturing nodes as you go along. You begin a hack from your point of entry in the system, the I.O. port. To capture a node, simply place the cursor over it and hold the interaction button. A wheel will appear, showing you the programs that can be used against it. Traveling from node to node is accomplished using bridges. A bridge can be unidirectional or bidirectional, as shown by its arrows. Each time you capture a node, there is a chance the network will detect your presence. The higher a node's rating, the greater the likelihood that you will be detected. If detected, don't panic. You still have a chance, you just need to hurry. The network will try to trace your entry point and boot you out of the system. If you manage to capture the registries before the network trace reaches your I.O. port, you'll be okay. Whoa. Looks kind of intense. So we have five attempts apparently. Security rating of one. So let's see here, we've got a capture, 60% detection. Not sure what the rest of these are, probably because uh, we have yet to, uh, to get that stuff. Okay, so we got this and we got this that we need to uh, to work with, apparently. Access granted. First egg. Is there really any reason that I need to go to this one? I don't think I did, because I just need the nodes. Anyways, we have unlocked it. Cool. Careful. Well, no blood. But who knows if there's any guards. Uh, we'll take that. What? Was that me? That better not have been me. The heck was that? Was that an alarm? That better not have been an alarm. That would piss me off. Let me tell you. I think it's just a decontamination room. From whatever I can tell. Okay, we definitely got some guards in here. Can see a few blips on my radar. Got about three guards down there right now. Got a couple points entry, two stairwells, and I think this one might be a little bit better 
Just because we're further away. Hmm. I don't like the angle that that guy is approaching at. He could see me. Let's get across here. What is this? Alright. So there's... Whoa. Most well, certainly four guards in here. Danger zone over here for sure. So I want to head over that way, apparently. He's facing this way, so I can't really do anything at the moment. And if that guy does not... Ah, oh man. He switches around by the time that this guy switches back this way. It's going to be a pain in the ass getting across this room. There's got to be an opening somewhere. Just need to wait a little longer, that's all. Now. That was my opening. Can I close this? No? Alright. Let's get the tutorial, shall we? After guards, security systems will be your prime area of concern, as they will trigger alarms that bring about heightened security. Trying to destroy these devices is a bad idea try instead to get around them. By timing your moves properly, you should be able to do so relatively easily. If an alarm does sound, guards will start looking for you. Fortunately, they won't sustain this level of alertness for long. Eventually, they will believe you fled the area and the alarm level will drop. I don't know if I've already set off an alarm at any point, but uh, we'll go with hopefully not. Got a camera there. Watch out. Who's there? Well. That was unexpected. I did not mean to open that door. 
Alright, let's see where this loads. Oh, great. That brings us back here. I really need to stop using objects when I just see a use suddenly in front of me. I'm like, oh, use. That must mean that there's something good. No, no, it means that there's a door and also that you're going to, uh, you're going to disturb whoever's behind that door because you aren't paying attention. Great. Alright, you know what? I think I will, uh, start this back up when I get an opening and head on through there, so be right back. Wow, it gave me an opening, like, as soon as I came out there. All I had to do was, uh, jump over the top of the stairs instead. Apparently, as long as their backs are somewhat turned to you, you, uh, you pretty much have an opening. Anyway, good enough, and we're not going to... Whoa, watch out. We're not going to, uh, we're not going to accidentally open that door again. That would be bad. Alright, camera's down that way. Let's see if we can't head over here. Okay. Definitely got what looks like way too many guards in here. And I'll be back in just a moment. Well, you may or may not be able to hear it right now, but there is a lawnmower moving back and forth outside my window, which is why I uh, decided to pause the video mid... Uh, walk through whatever I was doing. I think I'm going to uh, just go ahead and save right now and wait until this lawnmower is gone because um, it's definitely not going to make this very easy to record with all the noise. So I'll uh, see you all later. Bye for now.